Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. The topic is the yeast infections in men and women. And uh, the most important of them is the uh, vaginal yeast infections, you know. But before starting, I would like to request you to subscribe this channel for more informative videos every day. You know, the most uh, uh, vaginal yeast infections are caused by uh, the organism called as Candida albicans. You know? And the yeast infections are uh, very common and affect about uh, up to 75% of women at some point in their uh, life, you know. And the main symptoms of the vaginal yeast infection uh, is itching, is uh, burning discharge, and uh, the pain with the urination or the intercourse can also uh, occur, you know. So the main symptoms are uh, itching, uh, burning, uh, discharge, and pain while urination or pain during the sexual intercourse. Uh, and the treatment involves uh, uh, the tropical and the oral antifungal medications, you know. So your doctor will perform the physical examination. He will ask the questions about the uh, clinical uh, aspects like uh, the history of the disease, you know, and uh, he may advise some uh, lab tests, you know, just to confirm the diagnosis. And once diagnosed, then the treatment options are uh, uh, tropical and uh, antifungal medications, you know. And uh, it is possible uh, for a woman to transmit the yeast infection to uh, the male sex partners even uh, though the yeast infection is not considered to be the truly sexually transmitted disease you know so by using the condoms and other barrier methods you can uh, 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 wide to spread the you know to the male partner you know because it can occur in women uh, who are not sexually active as well you know so it's not sexually transmitted in fact you know uh, the treatment of the yeast infection in men, uh, like in women, uh, involves antifungal medications, you know. And uh, keeping the uh, vaginal area dry, uh, avoiding the irritant uh, chemicals, it can help to prevent the yeast uh, infections in women, you know. And uh, uh, consuming the foods with the probiotics may also help, you know. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you need more information about any disease, any medical condition, you can visit our website www.diseasesandtreatment.com and please do not forget to subscribe to this channel for more informative videos every day.